Please rise for the pledge. I pledge allegiance Please be seated. Today's lunch is hot dog on a bun, baked chips, baked beans, fruit, and milk. DeWitt County Pheasants Forever Youth and Family Shoot it will be Saturday, September 21st, 2019. Registration starts at 8 a.m. Where at Grace Farm in Clinton. Open to youth and adults of any age, and it costs the cost is free. Our youth and family shoot is aimed at providing a safety-oriented introduction to firearms. Lunch by Clinton IGA. Students, homecoming shirts are for sale through the end of this weekend. This year, you can buy your homecoming shirts and sweaters through an online web store. Check your school email for the link. If you prefer to pay with cash or check, you can order through Miss Nixon in the main office or Miss Ricky in room 12. Make sure to bring your payment with, with you. Shirt orders will be available for pickups for Ricky's room on Thursday, September. 26th. Vote for Homecoming Court. First round of voting is Thursday, September 19th for Homecoming Court. It will take place during an advisory. Student Council. There is a required meeting on Thursday, September 19th in the Commons during advisory. Bring something to write with. See Ms. Manning or Ms. Bennett if you have questions. Students in the Ag classes this year. Your FFA dues are due this Wednesday, September 18th. Please see Deal. Excel Club's Night in a Box is a fundraiser to collect items for the homeless. Excel Club will be collecting gently used adult hats, gloves, mittens, scarves, coats, sweatshirts, sweatpants, socks, blankets, and winter boots at the football game on Friday, September 20th. The nonprofit Dogono Disabilities is looking for volunteers to help out with their old pork nacho booth at the Apple Pork Festival. Good luck to the golf teams today. JV competes at Blue Ridge and Varsity competes at El Paso. Good morning, this is Preston Slow from CTV, and this is Mrs. Hazley, the study hall teacher. First of all, where did you go to college? I went to Illinois Central College in East Peoria and then transferred to the University of Illinois at Springfield. What other activities are you involved with at the high school? I am the head softball coach here at the high school. What made you want to become a teacher? I really enjoy seeing people overcome obstacles and succeed at things, and school can be a hard place for most people, so it's just a rewarding place to be to see people overcome those obstacles every day. Thank you for speaking with me, and welcome to Clinton High School. Thank you.